Okay, YouTube. I have converted a vinyl sliding door into a, a solar collector for hot water. Let's see, I've got my uh, tubing right here. Going around. Use the fins off of uh, off of the door frame itself to patch these little places right here. Some super glue where the rollers were. Put a uh, stuff that and caulked it all up. Put a piece of uh, aluminum strip there. Excuse me. I did the same thing here on the side. But uh, anyway, we're gonna go into some other videos here. And I'll show you how I make this. This is one of a set of two. All right, we'll see you on the next videos. Oh, I forgot. Here we go, there's the back of it. What I've done here is uh, basically an aluminum uh, sheet right here and trimmed it out and sealed it all off, such as that. So again, we're gonna be making other videos showing how we made this. All right, thank you. Okay, here we have the uh, final door itself all with the glass taken out you notice that all along it is all sealed to the inside all sealed to the inside there's no holes coming from the outside anywhere along here so with once this is sealed up from the back it's sealed against the glass okay okay basically here's the setup after the absorber is 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 uh, assembled right there and I've made these right here that surround the pipe and slides in 100% contact right there line them up cut the last one pretty simple stuff there and uh, what I've done here is after it's done I've, I've made marks I've, this is flipped over this is turned over it needs to turn over and we'll turn it over right now Okay, here with the uh, assembly, the absorber flipped over, is the back side up, face, the front side facing the glass. You can see that this is going to come down right inside of here, and this first half inch right here will be foam. First half inch right in here be foam. All oh, that'll be foam. What I've done here is I've made the lines on each side of this copper tube. I'm going to make this cut. I'm going to cut this out and cut it down. To right about this first uh, first line right here. You guys, again, I've done the same thing at this end right here. We've made the cut out for this one, and this one will be coming in. Uh, these two ends right here is where the other. This will join the other panel. Okay, so I'm going to make my cut using a regular skill saw. Okay, we're going to make this cut right with this. Cut. I had my saw set at the right depth right here so it cut cut good on both sides didn't cut into this facial right there you see that didn't cut into any part of that and it's right to here on the side right there okay Okay, we'll put the glass in now with uh, caulking. That'd be latex caulking in there on that lip. We'll put this glass right in. Same glass that came out of it. Fits perfect. Okay, what I have here is uh, some keepers, some things to keep the glass. Uh, in place right here and what I've done is cut this uh, uh, This is tile backer. It's a hardy board uh, That you get at Lowe's Home Depot, whatever 
I'll cut that into one inch strips and then cut some one inch squares, pre-drill the hole and I'll put these in with self-tapping screws at locations around, uh, around the area to secure that. Then I cut these pieces of foam to go in between here using the regular wood glue and press them in place. They need some clamping. You know, you can clamp it, but this is this this glue sets real quick and it's going to stick to this vinyl as good as anything else, other than maybe super glue. You don't have that, and you don't want to use that much super glue. So, uh, and then afterwards, this this strip will get glued right along top of here, and this will bring that flush right to the back here and allow the needed room inside for the pipes. Okay.